Hi, welcome to Technic Force Learning. In this video, I'm going to show you how to post an article in WordPress. I'm going to share with you some tips on creating unique content for your website that are used by professionals to make the WordPress blog site SEO friendly. If you haven't set up your blog in WordPress yet, we do have a separate video on how you can get started with WordPress so that you can start creating your own unique website. Let's get started. Once you're logged into your WordPress account, add a new post. There are two ways you can access it. One is from the top area, then click New, then Post. Second is from the left menus. Click Posts, then Add New. You are now in the WordPress editor for creating posts. Let's talk about each section of the editor. Here you can enter your title, the content section where we can format our text. As you click this icon, you can navigate through these blocks to include in your content. On the bottom is the SEO plugin called All-in-One SEO Path. Plugins are helpful for expanding your WordPress site's functionality. We do have a separate video, how to find free plugins for WordPress for absolutely anything you can think of to add in your site. The link can be accessed in the description below. This plugin can help in our blog's optimization. As you can see, there is a preview snippet of how your site's link will be seen in the search engine such as Google. As you scroll down, you can add a title, enter a description, which can be seen in the preview snippet here. On the right side, you can see the document and block settings. Here you can edit the visibility of your post if you want it to be public, private, or password protected. For publish, you can set it to immediately or schedule it to post at a particular date and time. Then post format with options such as gallery, image, standard, audio, and video. Categories. By default, all posts are set to uncategorized. If you want to add a new category, just click this link. Enter a category name, parent category, then click the add new button. Tags. Just enter the keyword tag you want to add here. Featured image. You can add a featured image which will be seen in addition to your post. Let's look at an example blog post. Here is the title of the article and the featured image. Discussion. You have the option to allow people to write their opinions in the comment section. Let's see an example. This post has the comment section here. If you want this removed, go back to the editor and under discussion and check allow comments. Now that we're already familiar with the sections of the editor, let's start creating an article or a blog post. Enter the title for your blog post. An SEO tip, remember that your title is the headline that will hook your reader's attention. It should be eye-catching and must contain the relevant keywords of what your content is about. Then type in the content. Let's click Preview to check how our article looks like from our site. This part we need to create a bullet style list. We can do that as we click this icon. Let's format this text to heading so that the text is bigger and the attention of viewers is focused on this heading since our article is a list content. List contents are pointing out a number of key points in a topic. For example, five steps to a great content. It basically includes numbers in the main topic. In this example, the eye-catching title is our headline, and our subheadlines are the 10 supporting tips that expand on what the beginners can learn about social media marketing. Now we've created our headline and subheadline, let's add some keywords. A good SEO practice is to use some keywords in our title, heading, and subheadings, introductory sentence, concluding paragraph. 
and create hyperlinks to other articles for that keyword. Let's apply that in our content. Take a preview. When we click this keyword, it will direct us to this article related to this keyword. Now let's add some tags. On the right side of the editor, click Tags. Type the tag that you want for this post. Let's preview. As you can see, the tags we included are located here. Let's see another example article with tags. Here you may see the tags are located underneath the headline. You may also access all your tags when you go to Posts, then Tags. These are all the tags we created. When posting articles, it's a good practice to create links to other articles related to your topic. We can add it in the end of our content. Enter the article name, highlight it, then create a hyperlink. As we take a look at the preview of the site, this will direct us to the link of this article. Now we're going to add an image and a featured image to our post. In our editor, select the area you want to place your image. Click the Add Block icon. Click Image. You will see this new part of our content. You may upload, select a media from your library, or insert a URL for that image. Either way you choose, you'll be inserting your image here. Now let's add a featured image. Go to Featured Image, Set Featured Image, select your image. It's a good SEO practice to include a text name for your images in the alt text. Just include a short description about your content. Click Select button. Let's embed a video to our post. We're going to add a URL that is from YouTube. From our editor, click this Add Block icon. Go to Embeds. You may find different platforms here. Since we're going to embed a video from YouTube, let's choose YouTube. Enter the video URL here, then click Embed. Another SEO tip is to include a caption for the embedded video. Now let's add a category that we'll add this article in. Go to Categories, click Add New Category. Now that we've finished our content, let's take a look how we can publish this post or have it scheduled for a later post. On the right side, go to Document, then Status and Visibility. If you want to publish it right away, this will be set by default to Public. You have the option if you want it to be visible to everyone, only visible to site admins and editors, or protected with a password. Let's choose Public. Now let's try to schedule it for later post. Go back to the editor, go to status and visibility, with publish, click this link. You'll be able to set the date and time when you want this content to be published. Now you've seen how you can create an article in WordPress the proper way. By taking note of the tips mentioned in the video, it can help with the optimization of your article. Feel free to subscribe to our channel to get more learning videos. If you have questions, you may ask in the comment section. Thank you for watching. You may visit our website at technicforce.com. We create cutting-edge internet marketing tools to help make you a successful internet marketer, including video marketing tools, social media marketing, email marketing tools, SEO,
e-commerce tools, and WordPress internet marketing plugins. Check us out!